let's talk about the heart. Let's talk about five myths about heart disease. Heart disease affects more men than women. Heart disease is the number one killer of both men and women, but it affects more women than men and more than all cancers combined. We need to get checked, mammograms, colonoscopies. This is part of a preventive, healthy life. But let's face it, heart disease is your number one health risk. So this month, let's commit to do something about it. Heart disease is for old people. Not true. It takes decades for heart disease to develop. And therefore, it begins much sooner than when you're older. If you have a family history of heart disease, your risk goes up. And new statistics show that women less than 55 years old actually have an increased risk. And there's an increased rate of women that age developing heart disease. So everyone needs to get checked, starting at age 20, because age just doesn't matter. Heart disease doesn't affect women who are thin? Says who? Women sometimes look great on the outside, but it's what's going on on the inside that really matters. Cholesterol, diabetes, blood pressure, family history, poor diet, stress, sedentary lifestyle, that's what matters. You may be thin, but it doesn't mean that you're immune to heart disease. The next myth, but I don't have symptoms. Let's talk about symptoms. There's that traditional Hollywood heart attack, that crushing chest pain, blue in the face, can't breathe, short of breath. That doesn't often happen with women. Women tend to get more subtle things, shortness of breath, jaw pain, back pain, nausea, vomiting, sleep disturbances, even flu-like symptoms. It's not that you're not having symptoms. You're not having the symptoms that you thought you should have. Here's a last myth. Heart disease runs in my family, so there's nothing I can do about it. Not true. 80 to 90% of the time, there is something that you can do about it. Making simple lifestyle changes can change everything. In fact, with lifestyle changes, about 627,000 people have changed and saved their lives. That's 330 people per day just by making simple lifestyle changes. So don't give in to your family history. Do something.